it's time to talk Christmas. What's going on guys, John Kelly here. And uh, as you can see, I got I got a new light for my videos. It's like a lot of fun to play with. And if you happen to be somebody who's married to a backpacker or you've got a relative who's a backpacker, boyfriend, a girlfriend, best friend, anybody who's into backpacking, you know that they love new gear. And that's what this video is all about. We're gonna talk about the best items that you can get for your loved one for $20 or less. But before we get too far into this video, I will let you know that a lot of these items that are on the list will have affiliate links below. That doesn't change anything about how you order the gear or anything like that. All it does is it says, if you use those links, I get a little bit of a kickback for having them in my video. And if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to the channel by clicking on the subscribe button right down here, as well as hitting that notification bell so you find out anytime one of these videos drops. And if you like the video, Give me that good old thumbs up. The first item on the list, the numero uno, the one thing at the top of this list is the Tokes Titanium Long Handled Spork. This is the one with the polished end that kind of feels like your silverware at home. Uh, I'm a big fan of it, been using this one in particular for almost two years. Huge fan of this. You can get these on campsaver.com for only $10.95. Most other places are selling for $12 or $13. But you want to talk about a great stocking stuffer? You have one of these in your loved one's stocking, they're gonna be very thankful that you were thinking about them. The number two item on this list is the BRS 3000 stove. I've had this one since 2018. It still works great. You cannot beat this stove for the weight to cost ratio. This thing weighs in at about 25 grams less than an ounce, and it comes in at about $17. You can buy these on Amazon. They come in under all kinds of different names, but the one that I have is the BRS 3000T. This comes in at $16.58 on Amazon. Check it out. It's a great little stove. Again, you want a great stocking stuffer. It's small. It comes with this little sack right here. Toss that in there, put that in someone's uh, stocking, and you're gonna make somebody very, very happy. The next item on the list is the GSI Java Drip. This is an awesome little piece of gear. You can pick these up for $10.95. Uh, it weighs just a few ounces and it is great. If you're somebody who likes uh, pour over coffee, it's really easy to use. These little things here clip onto your cup. You put in your fresh ground coffee here, pour the hot water over and enjoy it. The cleanup is not bad. It's pretty easy. I've heard a lot of other people say it's difficult. I found no difficulty in cleaning this thing out and I've been using it now for a year and a half. The great thing about this is you can leave it in the box, pack it up, throw it under the tree, or you can take it out of the box, flatten it down real nice and flat, shove that into a stocking and it makes another great stocking stuffer. You're gonna find that like all of these make fantastic stocking stuffers. You can find this for $10.95, 11 bucks on almost all of your retailer sites, REI, Backcountry, Camp Saver, they're all over Amazon. This is great for that backpacker that wants to have their morning brew out in the backcountry. Next up is the X Mug by Sea to Summit. I love these. I love the fact that they can pack down real easy. It's 16 ounces, so you can have a big cup of coffee in the mornings. If you're not a big coffee drinker or a big cup of coffee drinker, they do have the X Cup, which is this little guy right here. A uh, little bit smaller, as you can see, but I know a lot of people who really love this. It's a little bit of weight savings. Either one is fantastic. You can get this mug right here for about $14 if you go to seatasummit.com and pick that up directly from the manufacturer. You'll find these on Amazon for up to $23. Don't do that. If you're gonna purchase it, go to seatasummit.com and pick them up from there. They have all the colors, all the choices, and the best price I've been able to find. Now we're gonna move away from food for a second and show you these. These are the Injinji Spectrum Trail Midweight Crew Socks. That's a lot of words for a pair of socks. If you've been watching my channel for any time, you know that I have moved away from darn tough socks that I started out on and I've moved solely to Injinji socks. 
and I'm not complaining. These things have been great. You may be looking at these and thinking toe socks. I am not wearing toe socks. Well, I'm going to tell you, if you're somebody who's prone to blisters and for some reason I am prone to blisters, especially between my toes, these are fantastic for people who are prone to blisters. So if you have a, a backpacker in your family who really struggles with getting blisters all the time, get these for them. They come in about $19. You can get them on Ngingi.com. Uh, going there's your best chance because you can pick out any of the different choices that they have on the website. Uh, everything's in stock and the price is the same whether you shop directly from Ngingi or you go to Backcountry or Amazon or anybody else. But go over to Ngingi.com and check these out. $19 for these amazing socks. And I can promise you, whoever you get these for, they may look at you funny at first, but they wear these a couple times out on the trail and they will not be laughing anymore. The next item on the list are these neck gaiters. Now you've probably heard them called Buffs, but there is a company called Buff that has trademarked the name and trademarked everything so that these aren't Buffs, they're called neck gaiters. This is by Wildly Good. If you go over to wildlygoods.com, you can pick these up for $9. And gaiters are such a useful, useful item to have when you're on the trail. Don't believe me? My friend Jeremiah Stringer actually did a video on all the uses of a neck gaiter on his channel. I'm gonna link that up above so that you guys can check that out. But buffs can be used for dozens of uses, whether it's as a balaclava to keep your face warm at night, something to wear around your neck to keep the bugs off your neck, whether you're using it as, as a pot cleaner or something to pick up a hot pot. These things can be used for so many things. Buffs are an incredible purchase that you can make. And for nine bucks, awesome stocking stuffer. Like I said, all of this stuff can be stocking stuffers, but you get them one of these and they're gonna be very, very happy. Next up on the list is something that I promise you your backpacker will be thankful for, and that is this little insect repellent spray known as permethrin. This is such great stuff because you can spray this on your clothing, on your tents, your hammocks, your tarps, anything that you're gonna be wearing or sleeping in out in the backcountry, and this will keep the bugs off of them. And you can put this on at the beginning of the summer, and you can backpack for two or three months and not have to reapply. Uh, so this is fantastic stuff. If you get this 18 ounce bottle, it's like 11 bucks on Amazon right now. This 12 ounce pump bottle is, is only $13, both under 20 bucks. But again, something that your backpacker will be thanking you for. Because if there's something we can all agree on, we hate bugs in the backcountry, especially mosquitoes and ticks and gnats and black flies and all the things that are out there that can bother you. You wanna make your backpacker happy, get him a bottle of this stuff. And if you found any value in this video whatsoever, smash the like button. Kind of think it's dumb, but I kind of want to fit in. Don't forget that Jeremiah Stringer and myself also have the Backpacking Podcast, where we interview backpackers and outdoor enthusiasts in every realm of the outdoors and share that with you on our podcast. You can also find out all about my trips, where I'm planning on going, pictures from where I've been, if you go on over to my Instagram. Hey guys, thanks for tuning in. Stay strong, hike long, and I'll catch you on the next go around.